the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. May our Lord be with you. Call to mind our sins. Lord Jesus, you came to reconcile us to one another and the Father. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. You heal the wounds of sin, division. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. You deceive for us with your Father, Lord, have mercy. Lord, Lord. Almighty God, have mercy on us. Forgive us our sin and bring us to everlasting life. We pray, O oh God, grant that we always conform our wills to yours and serve your majesty in sincerity of heart. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Every single one of us remembers it, even though many of us are getting long in the tooth. 
I can't speak for the people wives at home. But every one of us is a good Catholic. We remember the night, maybe the day, that they marched us in for the sacrament of confirmation. And you sat here in the first five, six rows of whatever church you're from at home, people at home, maybe watching from Florida, I don't know. And you sat there trembling that the bishop was going to ask you a question. And you, know, you could see strategies. Like when I sit up there watching, you have like the kid in the front row will be slinking down in the front seat hoping that the bishop doesn't see him because if he doesn't see him, well, he figures he can't call on him. And there's games you play. Like sometimes there'll be a six foot nine inch kid in the front row. And the bishop will say to the pastor, well, who's these small kids in the front row? And, and the pastor will say, yeah, that kid knows all the answers. So I wanted him in the front row. So I look good because the pastor wants to look good. But you might even remember some of those questions. What is a sacrament? What is confirmation? And if the bishop was challenging, he would ask, what are the fruits of the Holy Spirit? Now that's a list. And she just read them for us from St. Paul's letter to the Galatians. And it all, he, might, he might have asked, well, this would be taking it a step further, what are the, the sins? that Paul talks about, immorality, licentiousness, etc. Probably wouldn't ask that. But that question, what are the fruits of the gifts, the, the fruits of the Holy Spirit come from 2,000 years ago? And she just read them for us. And we're still teaching them to the kids. If you come to one of our confirmation retreats, my high school kids give a short talk on each one of those fruits. And I hear some very good stories, some exceptional stories. But the bottom line of this little talk is, do you see the mistake we've made for years? They're not a list to be memorized. And that's what the kids are afraid he's gonna call on me. They're things to be practiced. They're things to be practiced. I don't care if the kids, kids look at their cell phone today and get a list in three seconds. Practicing them takes 30 years. Patience, kindness, gentleness, faithfulness, chastity, and that's only half of them. Those are hard things to practice. We adults who are watching this are still trying to master them. And we will until the day we die. Let's try to do it well today. Let us stand, my friends, and we'll offer our petitions.
Pray, friends, that my sacrifice and yours be acceptable to God, our Almighty Father. May the Lord accept sacrifice your hands, but pray to the glory of His name for our good of all the Holy Church. Grant us, the Lord, a sincere respect for your gifts, that through the purifying action of grace, we may be cleansed by the very mysteries we serve. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. May the Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. Lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere to give you thanks. Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, in goodness you created us, and he was justly condemned, in mercy you redeemed us in Christ. Through him the angels praise you, dominions adore, powers tremble before you. Heaven. And the Virgin of Heaven and the Blessed Seraphim worship together with exaltation. May our voices, we pray, join with theirs as we say, Holy, 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 Holy Lord God of hosts, Heaven and earth are through your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest.
world grant us peace. To all the Lamb of God, behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my room. Only say the word. Let us pray. Grant, O Lord, we pray, that benefiting from participation in heavenly things, we may be helped by what you give us in this present age, and be prepared for gifts that are eternal. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. May the Lord be with you. And God bless us, our families, in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen. Come forward to receive the Eucharist. Thanks. Amen. 